Tell me that. How many confessions? Twelve dozen, last time I checked. None of them had any details. Until this morning. And then they all had details. Some genius in Duluth PD took a photograph of Elise Nichols' body with his cell phone, shared it with his friends, and then Freddie Lowndes posted it on tattlecrime.com. Tasteless. Do you have trouble with taste? My thoughts are often not tasty. No, mine. No effective barriers. Oh, I build forts. Associations come quickly. So do forts. Not fond of eye contact, are you? The eyes are distracting. You see too much, you don't see enough. And, and it's hard to focus when you're thinking, um, oh, those whites are really white, or he must have hepatitis, or oh, is that a burst vein? So, yeah, try to avoid eyes whenever possible. Jack? Yes. I imagine what you see and learn touches everything else in your mind. Your values and decency are present, yet shocked at your associations, appalled at your dreams. No forts in the bone arena of your skull for things you love. Whose profile are you working on? Whose profile is he working on? I'm sorry, Will. Observing is what we do. I can't shut mine off any more than you can shut yours off. Please, don't psychoanalyze me. You won't like me when I'm psychoanalyzed. Will. Now, if you'll excuse me. I have to go give a lecture on psychoanalyzing. Maybe we shouldn't poke him like that, Doctor. Perhaps a less uh, direct approach. What he has is pure empathy. He can assume your point of view, or mine, and maybe some other points of view that scare him. It's an uncomfortable gift, Jack. Mm. Perception's a tool that's pointed on both ends. This cannibal you have him getting to know. I think I can help Goodwill see his face. 